of the uh, Soyuz vehicle. Uh, this process should take just a few minutes, and I, the Soyuz commander, having completed his third flight into space, will. Uh, he'll be uh, carried into uh, the center seat of the three uh, comfortable chairs that are set up in front of the cameras. Uh, he'll be uh, getting a very clear view of that. Out for them. So, uh, Rob, I want to thank you for calling in, giving us an update. Uh, As a cosmonaut and a Danish astronaut. Uh, who spent uh, a short time aboard the International Space Station. Careful. Please don't stand in front of the camera. And okay, very good. Thank you, Dan. Uh, they are in the process of... Uh... And we're standing by. We can see the crew members back. Any idea who it is yet? Uh, I'm trying to get into position to see. Second of the three crew members uh, out of the top of the hatch. They Scott Kelly, back on Mother Earth after 340 days in space, Dan. Thumbs and up. We got a great view of him now. Uh, the folks here in Mission Control Houston letting out a, a very big cheer. Scott Kelly, uh, as you just said, returned after 340 days in space. NASA's one-year crew member uh, conducted for him. Kelly now being loaded over into his chair. Here comes, please step back. Step back and don't interfere. And we're seeing a big smile from Scott Kelly there. You can see just to his right, Steve Gilmore, uh, Scott's prime flight surgeon for his year in space. And back over at the capsule, we can see uh, Mikhail Kornienko, the other thankful for your jackets, but for somebody who hasn't uh, had the breeze on his face for almost a year, I bet it. Scott Kelly absolutely relishing the fresh air out here in the mid-morning hours here in uh, the southern step of Kazakhstan, breathing deeply, enjoying every second of his return to Earth. And we just saw down there on the step in Kazakhstan. One year mission, guys. I'm fine. To uh, undergo about an hour to an hour and a half worth of field testing, uh, which is uh, Sergey Volkov uh, uh, just a few feet away from me. Uh, his father is uh, kneeling down right next to him. Uh, what a picture that is, father and son, cosmonaut heritage that has been several decades of Russian space history. Everything as we, taught, as we were taught. Satellite phone in his hand, uh, assuming making uh, about 24 hours away or so from now. Uh, would you like to hold an apple? Uh, not to eat one.